to be right. Come on, y'all, what time is it? What's your collection called? Rooted. Back up! Back it up! That's you! And should we turn the other music yeah. off? Yeah, we can turn them around and off. Yes, keep that one on. I'm gonna turn the one because I can't take pictures if it's off. Okay, turn your Bluetooth off. Am I in the picture frame? Turn your Bluetooth off. Yes. I look good, don't I? Because I can't take pictures myself. I got it. You just said your phone. Oh, you didn't even get my okay? Wait a minute, I'm trying to do the video. Hold on. Do the show cool. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that one for TikTok on y'all TikTok. Then you got to be right. Come on, y'all, what time is this? Because I gotta finish my dinner. No. Right. I gotta finish my dinner though. Okay, can we get in a picture with the girls? Okay, okay y'all. That was a surprise. Good morning, party people. It is currently 6.30 a.m. in the morning. I'm here with our models. Sister number one, sister number two, technically sister number three. We have all of the clothes here, all of the different supplies that we may or may not be using, and we are just getting ready, so. Let's do it. Mind herself. This is Dinah Claudi D. T. Cor Couture. So, what's your overall plan for today? So, today we are shooting six different looks, um, all inspired by different natural hairstyles and black women. You know how I do. And I'm left for today is, you know, to, you know, have fun, really, you know, I can be a little high strung, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, yeah, just a little bit. I'm not too, you know, I'm not too bad. <laughs> but, um, you know, have fun, shoot these looks, enjoy our time in this space, you know, and just make it, make it a good show. Okay, that's okay, that's what I like to hear. What's your collection called? Rooted. Could ever change, we fly and we fall.
Hello, <laughs> how are you doing? It's, it's, it's been a minute. It's been a minute. As you can see, I just woke up. I know, I really need to fix my sleeping schedule. If you don't know, you should know that this month, it's February, Black History Month, aka Black History Month, and I have already started posting my series. To catch up today, if you don't already know, this series is called Rooted. It's gonna have six looks, each inspired by a natural black hairstyle. I've already posted the first look. The second look is gonna be posted later this week. I just posted the reel. Sorry, y'all. I just got a text from Michaela. Michaela was this really sweet girl that I met at the HFR designer retreat when I was in New York last year. And she just texted me checking in, which makes me feel real good when people check in on me. So I'll respond to her in a bit. But I just posted on Instagram. Now I'm gonna post on TikTok. And I have a love-hate relationship with TikTok. It's very hard for me to get on this app and get off, like get right off. So I'm gonna go ahead and post this reel and then um, I'm gonna tell y'all what we got in store for today. I recently discovered, okay, it wasn't recent, I didn't discover it, my roommate did, but there's this lovely combo you can do with your tea chips. So, the regular combo, as we know, is, you know, you get your guacamole, either with the guacamole, but have you ever considered making some Mexican corn? Making some Mexican corn, which don't ask me how to make it, I don't know, it's corn and cheese of some capacity, and you put it, oops. You put it on the tortilla chip as well, right? Ooh. Hey, cutie. Hey, Marley. 
He never recognizes us when we first come. That's why he's shaking a little. Hey. Hey. Why you act like you don't know me? Why you acting like you don't know me? Marley. So get that over your head. Hello, hello, party people. How are you? Welcome, welcome back. So as you can see, I did my hair and it looks okay. The ponytail to me is looking a little thick. It's looking a little thick. I'm, I'm kind of scared it might fall off. So y'all have seen me working on a project and essentially I'm working on Valentine's sweater vests. For me and my boyfriend to wear to take pictures for Valentine's Day. Initially, it was going to be like this sort of JCPenney concept, but then I looked up how, how much it costs to take pictures of JCPenney. I was like, no. So I'm just going to take it <laughs> in me, in me casa. You know what I'm saying? I've actually been working on these for a while, but I've just been really slow about actually getting these done. Like I actually finished this one like three weeks ago. Like I had, I've had this idea for a minute and originally I was going to make it a polo. But then I was like, you know what, let me just make some sweater vests because I don't feel like making those sleeves. So this is the red one. This is the one that he'll be wearing. So I tried that on him last night and his head fits through the hole, which is nice. I definitely still need to work on like my ribbing around here. I don't know how people make it neat. Like, do y'all crochet y'all ribbing or do y'all knit it? Like, how can y'all make it like really neat? And not only neat because I mean, it's fairly neat, but like make it like consistent. The only thing left to do is to sew in the side. So I've marked here the armhole size that I want for it. Sew in the sides and then do the ribbing around the sleeves and then it's done. Well, at least the base of it is done. I also wanted to try and be extra and like, I want to crochet a heart on here. I wanted to crochet like stuffed hearts or stuffed teddy bears, um, but I'm not sure if I have enough yarn time or energy to do that to be really real with you so i'm gonna take it one step at a time we're gonna finish the sweater vest so i'm gonna make it my goal to finish it and then i want to take the pictures this weekend i need to take them this weekend and then this is mine part of me worries that i made it too short because i'd be really forgetting about the tatas when i be making stuff for myself but i was going for a much more fitted look for mine i'm hoping that it'll look good on. We're not gonna just wear these, we're gonna have button up shirts underneath. So I was going for like a more crop look for mine anyway. So I'm just hoping that like it, it looks how I was trying to make it look. So we're making progress in there. So I'm just gonna finish off the sleeves and then if I finish them off in time, I'll give y'all a little, you know, supposed, uh, well, should I show you? Make, yeah, I'll show y'all what it look like, yeah. Um. 
we make each other proud and you know we don't look the same. Right, and then, and then like, 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 the back right door, like, like, I got squeezed out around the corner, it was too tight, and it was just, and then there was tinder to the car. Ugh, <laughs> otherwise, you know, pretty good. I would definitely say, like, job hunting has been all-consuming, but I yeah. feel like, you know, I'm also in a new city, so I've been trying to explore more about yeah. the city. All right, y'all, this is my fit check. Boom, bada the bang. Of course, we stay wrecking Black-owned businesses. Tico Couture, Brandon Blackwood. So, you know, just a cash, cash outfit. Me and the roommate are going to dinner, going to a friend's place for dinner. So just keeping it casual, but also keeping it cute. Also finished both of the sweaters. The bases. I gotta obviously sew in all of the ends. Y'all know how it is. But I'm so proud of myself. These look so good. And they're super colorful. Not your normal colors, but I'm excited to just wear them even um, beyond Valentine's Day. So gonna hopefully add some more details to this tomorrow. Tomorrow's my last day to add anything else that I want to add and to sew in all of the ends because we're taking the picture Sunday morning. But I'm excited. It was also very quick and it just feels so good that I was able to finish two, not one, but two sweater vests. It didn't take months and months to do like it did for the Root collection. So just feel a huge dopamine after this. And I test, I test, you'll see how it looks on him later. I test, I, um, what do you, I fitted him in it and it looks so good on him. Like it fits him perfectly. I'm so proud of myself. Definitely want to continue branching out on my menswear. So anyway, going to dinner. And uh, it's, it's a YA okay. yeah, 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 well, hey, here's this thing, right, so. Don't hear what you don't listen, hey, 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 you better pay attention. On an island in the sun, we'll be playing, having fun. And it makes me feel so fine, I can't control my brain. Wait a minute, I'm passing out with no loose. Just like you, just like you. Hold her hand and give her a hug. She was married to the man. He wasn't dog. His name was Lee. He drove to see. He picked her up from school promptly at 3 o'clock. I'm waking up to ash and dust. I wipe my brow when I sweat my rust. I'm breathing in the chemicals. I'm breaking in. Killed it. <laughs> smashed it, smashed it. Another hit, another hit, you already know what it another is. Another dapper. Big Britain in this, you already Big know. Britain you can't it. cross me. Bring me a bottle of water. <laughs> I do need a bottle of water. Actually, yeah. We're on route to brunch. We are wearing our matching couple sweater vests right now, which I'm very, I'm very proud of how they came out. Also got my hat on because my hair underneath, somebody got to train me, teach me how on earth I'm supposed to uh, rock the slick down look because my hair don't be slicking down like it needs to be slicking down. Okay, but... I need your help. What? Look at me, sweat. Why are you sweating? <laughs> I started recording you. I was oh. like, should I stop and press the un <laughs> should I tap? I didn't know what you was going to say. <laughs> Holly, hmm? can you tell the people what you cooking? 
Hey y'all, I'm cooking some chicken fried rice, chicken fried rice. Right now I have the rice in the wok. Um, I wasn't able to dehydrate it over, overnight, but you know, put it in there for the fridge, I mean, for a couple of hours. And now I mixed in some soy sauce, some sesame oil, garlic powder, salt and pepper. One second, more sesame oil. I'm about to pull this in, about to pull this in. Woo! Stop pouring now. <laughs> One second. Stop pouring now. Okay, thirty seconds. One, two. I got three. the onions. That's tsunami wind. <laughs> that was that was authentic. Yeah. It's been thirty seconds. Stop pouring in. Okay, yeah, pour it in, pour it in. Everything. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Go, 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 go. Take video, take video, take video. Drop the meat. Okay. You got it. Yo. Girl, nothing coming out of that. Right. Ow. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm sorry. <laughs> Look at the steam coming up. Oh! <laughs> oh, I can grab it right. I can grab it right. Just, just look. Just look. Okay. Right foot, right foot, right foot down. Let go of the right foot. Are you smiling? Okay, no, 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 no. <laughs> sharp so a little farther from your first finger. Oh. You're on the wrong string. I'm on the wrong strings. And then go back down. Open. And third finger. Too high. Too sharp. Just to keep going again. And then touching with your second finger. You got the first finger. Come on! Come on! That's what I'm talking about! That's what I'm talking about! 
Take a bow. Take a bow for the camera. Show the people back home. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, Our star pupil. Thank y'all. <laughs> I'm a body later now. After what, like 40 minutes maybe? I don't know what time it is. <laughs> like 40 minutes. That's awesome. Hey party people. So I just, I want to come in here and deeply apologize. Deeply apologize because I'm not sure if this vlog has been all over the place or not, or even if I vlogged. Like I, I genuinely don't know what's really been going on this week. I have been just a mess up here. It's just, it's crazy. It's crazy. I want to keep things as positive as possible on here. Life be hard, life be hard. And if you are watching this and you're, you know, in college or a high school student, like, you know, you, you haven't entered post-grad life yet, whether that's post-college or post-high school. And it might not be like this for everybody, but it is for me and a lot of the people that I know, okay, that I'm friends with, you know, it's not easy. There is a lot of trials and tribulations that come with this age. What I'm finding with a lot of people that I know, like across the board, but especially in my age group of being a post-grad is that the job market just does not feel like it's meant for us in a lot of ways in terms of, you know, they're not hiring, they're laying us off, they're just requiring that you have this many years of experience and you can't get the experience because they're not hiring. They really are just not doing right by us. And I think I'm gonna go into further detail on this in a future video. Let me know. If, well, no, I'm going to, I'm going to, because that's just what's on my mind right now because I see it affecting so many people, including myself. And you know, that has definitely been something that's just been playing on and on in my mind. Oh, so my sister got me this camera for my Christmas present. Keep in mind, it's February right now. I have not opened it up. Mm -mm, I have not opened it up. So I'm going to open it right now, actually. Let me go get it, one sec. Here it is, Merry Christmas to me from my little sister, Holly. Thank you so much. She helped me invest in my YouTube channel because I want to get back into it, okay? Y'all, hold me accountable. I'm trying to post every single week, okay? Hold me accountable. I am going to do it because I do enjoy video making. But I've been scared to be on camera because my life ain't been the best. You know, and it's hard to get on camera and just be like, hi, welcome back to another YouTube video. You know, that's just been very challenging for me. Okay, so she got me the Yeti mic. She got me the Yeti mic, right? But um, she got it to me, she got it in silver. And um, I should have specified what color I wanted because I didn't want silver. I wanted gold or at least a one with color. But let's see what this looks like. Yeah, so life, you know, life has been life in. Life has been life in. But I've been trying to enjoy the moments, the beautiful moments at the same time. Like, um, I did a terrible job of vlogging this. But Sunday, Sunday. Oh, my goodness. Sunday. So much was going on Sunday, which good, good and bad things going on Sunday. So for me personally, it was a very good day because... You know, I had brunch, I went on a brunch date with the roomie, I hung out with my sister, took some pictures for these cute Valentine's Day pictures that me and my boo took. We went to the museum, that was a lot of fun. Highly recommend if you're in Atlanta going to the High Museum. And then we celebrated with the Super Bowl. <sighs> and you know, Beyonce released a new song, which I was like, ah! You know, I'm a Beyonce stan, in, lo in love with that woman. But okay, so here it is, it's got some uh theme the bobbies probably sharing how to use them oh okay you know it's not silver it's white it's white that's even worse oh no i'm just kidding i'm just kidding i'm so grateful thank you so much holly for getting me this so let me take it out of the plastic do i move this thing how do i okay i think it is silver it's hard to tell. It's hard to tell. It's a bit bright. It's a bit bright on camera. Gonna have to figure out how to fix that. We do have a cool new mic. Please, please, please know that I hope that you all will be seeing a huge rebrand across my account, across, you know, all of my accounts. And, and not rebrand, but just a huge change. I plan on being 
way more consistent, like incredibly consistent. Uh, again, I have just been really struggling on the content creation press, being able to show up on camera. I've been feeling so much imposter syndrome. I've just been doubting myself a lot. And, you know, I'm kind of over it. Like being here, being able to talk with you guys, it definitely makes me feel better. You know, now that I'm sitting here doing it, it's a, it's 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 nice. It's nice to have, even though y'all aren't here in person, like when y'all watch this and y'all comment and stuff like that, it's nice to know that I have people here that I can talk to that we can kiki and talk in the comments and, you know, just build community, which I think is incredibly necessary, incredibly important, and honestly something that I need. I crave, I'm missing community so bad since I've moved because because I, I don't really, you know, have a lot of friends here. I've been getting to know some people, which is cool. But like on the day to day, like I'm not really interacting with people. I'm by myself most of the time. And so, you know, I don't know if some of y'all like that. You know, maybe it's just me. I don't know. But, um, you know, I just I, I want to have fun with this again. And I just need a, I need an escape from from just the 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 difficulty that is adulting and that is life you know what I mean I just I need an escape from it you know I need I need something I need something for myself and I I think this is it you know as with many journeys I I've always felt like I've had to do it on my own and you know I've I've, I've asked for help I've applied to things and you know haven't necessarily gotten the result that I've hoped to be getting uh but honestly like if y'all if I could rely on y'all, honestly, just just for your your words of encouragement and just to get to know y'all more, I think think that's gonna be what I what I need in this moment. To be real with you, you know, excuse the mess on my desk, but yeah. So that's enough rambling for today. Again, I'm so grateful for y'all to have stuck around. Be excited, be excited because I I do think that this is gonna be the hot spot like this is going to be the place that everyone wants to be trust me it's going to be the place that everyone wants to be like everybody they are not ready okay so y'all are ahead y'all are here y'all are ahead and in it and um it's gonna be good it's gonna be good like I'm, I'm ready to bring the positive energy back you know so yeah until next time uh, y'all can catch me in the next video. I don't know what it is just yet, but hopefully by the time I post this, I'll have a full posting schedule and whatever. And like I said, you guys will see a change. I will not ghost and disappear from here anymore. If I ghost and disappear, y'all better come clown me. Okay? I'm holding myself accountable right now. You should see me every single week. If you don't see me every single week, then clown me. Unless there was an emergency, but otherwise clown. All right, I'm talking too much. Take care. Bye.